right. I think it's more the chat's just really antsy to hear the announcement since we mentioned it. <laughs> well, that is true. That is true. It's big news. Yeah, it's scary. Honestly, I'm scared. I'm putting it off because I'm nervous. Maybe I can put it off more. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Just scared and nervous, too. Yeah, you guys heard? Okay. All right. Let me just first start by leading into this by saying, like, you guys might know uh, Sekuno. Sekuno. because he's psycho. <laughs> or psychic, I guess. He doesn't seem very psycho. He seems very mild-mannered and nice. Uh, Saikuno was a big uh, Twitch streamer that moved to YouTube exclusive. Uh, along with, this has been happening a lot. Like Valkyrie was a big one. Ludwig was a big one. They've all come over to YouTube gaming. And um, the one thing they've been doing is making these huge video announcements to announce their epic departure. And I think, well, here's Valkyries. They're all, um, here's Valkyries. Um, let's just get an idea here. Throughout my entire life, there's always been one- Bro, this video's in fucking 2,100K. <laughs> I need all of those pixels. Duh, no way. They make these like crazy overproduced videos. I think this is something YouTube is like, yo, let's do this to get the hype out. So let's watch. Remain consistent. Am I getting a claim for this fucking music? This da 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 It sounds royalty free to me, but like just has that vibe, but. After the longest of days, sorry I'm late. I just got back from work. It's what inspired me to keep going. The bags is through my game most store. difficult moments. This community has always been there for me. These past oh, few man. years, every aspect of my life has changed because of you all. I've been able to give back to others, especially those I love. You know what? Her mom didn't seem that hyped for getting a house. Yeah, and you know what? <laughs> Everyone got a flex. You know, I... <sighs> Look, I bought my parents a house, and I didn't even fucking get to flex it, okay? And now I said it. Well, now you are. Yeah. But I'm saying, everyone got to do, like, keys and shit. I did it, okay? I mean, uh, please big... clap for me. That was very cool of you. By your parents' house. Please clap for me, okay? Thank you. Just want a little fucking cred here. I want you guys to think I'm a good person. It's not fair what they, they get to flex all this shit. Especially those I love. Mom's not even excited though, you're right. You've watched me grow. My mom is like, it's too big. If the house is too big, I'm gonna have to clean it all. <laughs> she complains like crazy, dude. She actually did. It's too big of a house. It's just me and your dad. I'm gonna have to clean it all. What am I gonna do with this backyard? I can't do gardening back here. <laughs> she loves it now, by the way. Okay, that's good. Yeah. But that's just what I was dealing with. Dubrick? You know, at first, since I haven't talked about this before, my parents wanted that to buy them a fucking trailer home. It's like a modified home. They're like trailers. Mm -hmm. And um, it was in Newberry Park, set in like a woody kind of, in the woods. Sure. And I was like, why the fuck do you guys want to live here? And it was during, and there was like huge wildfires going on. And I was like, this whole place is gonna burn down. Besides the fact that why do you want to live in a trailer park? I'll buy you a house. And she'll, she's, she's very upset because I was like, I'm not buying that house, you know, it's just, it's ridiculous. Well, the next summer, that whole fucking place burned to the ground. Oh, no way. Yep. Oh, my God. Yeah. Well, you made the right call, I guess. It's just so weird. I, my mom is just such a lunatic, but we love her for that. I mean, I could see the appeal of living in the woods. No, but like, in a tra she's in a trailer park, and like, it's just, it wasn't... 
If it's the one I'm thinking of, I, I know what you're talking about. I used to ride bikes through there. And it is really beautiful there. Yeah. It is very beautiful, but I just didn't. I didn't get the whole thing. But there you have it. So, uh, continuing on. To the person I am today. And I'm so excited to keep moving forward. It's time for the next chapter. Are you ready for something new? Damn, bro. I, you got me hyped AF right now. So there you have it. Mm. And then the new one, wh which was by Saikuno. Um, this one was fucking epic, bro. Is it in 25K? Is it, is it pushing the boundary of pixels? Let's see. I believe that's just. 4K. Oh, bro, take 1080. this shit offline. 1080. L, L, fucking what? L, shut him down. Cancel the partnership, YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, Saikuno uh, just recently moved, and he also made a trailer that was like, bro. And first of all, no hate, obviously, sweet guys, both of them, love them. It was very dramatic, and I was just really crying the whole time because. Um, well, it's been a good run. That's the name of his video. Damn, bro. Oh shit, we're in his eyeball. This is where it all started. In a tiny shed in my parents' backyard. I never planned on becoming a streamer. I just wanted to play some games. And Damn, bro, like, I'm sorry, but this is powerful. I know. This oh. is really, but I had to pause to collect myself. <laughs> he used to play in his, back, in his parents' shed, y'all. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And make some friends. And I did. Powering up. I started off playing League. Look at it, bro. At least pretend like you're playing. Is he's just not even moving? Let's see those. Let's see those actions per minute. <laughs> right. What the hell are you doing? You're not even moving Look your damn. Clicks. Yeah. Playing League. Then Minecraft. Valorant. You see this lobster? Among Us. What do you mean, let's go, boy? GTA. You know you have 24 hours. I met some cool people, and made some really good friends. And, I met all of you guys. Damn, dude, it's been a journey, Say, hasn't it? Are you ready to go? Yeah, uh, one sec. <laughs> uh, oh no, he brought the fucking thing! That was from his, the shed, y'all. to do what I've always done just in a new place Shit, bro hell no so he went to YouTube Wow and it was so powerful too because like it was like he changed the fucking world bro by playing among us and that I feel that <laughs> you know so I think the reason I'm watching these videos is not to say anything negative about those two beautiful souls and I really do think they're nice and I'm not I'm not trying to say anything but they were a little bit dramatic I think we can all agree I think you could a little melodramatic you could say that. I mean you play among us dude chill out it's not that <laughs> fucking serious I'm just saying I'm just saying so uh, with all that being said well I'm this is scary I'm scared to do this guys but I have a huge announcement and, uh, well, you have it queued up, Dan? Yeah. All right, let's just roll it, guys. Ever since I was young, I knew I had to be a podcaster. But I never could have guessed where that journey would take me. From humble beginnings across the globe to exciting new paths into unexplored territories. I laughed. I cried. I shit myself. I got canceled, 
I made friends that will last a lifetime, lost those friends, got canceled again, got a face rash from putting too much cortisone cream on my face. Oh shit, for external anal and genital itching. Diarrhea again, this time it looks like pesto. This is my weapon, my Excalibur. When I pulled this from the stone so many years ago, I knew I was destined for greatness. Some say the sword is mightier than the pen, but you know what does more damage than all of them? A microphone with a master orator behind it, me. I'm thinking like iconic, iconic, is that a word? No. Nope. There's been ups, downs, but through it all there was you, the audience, who hates me on most days, but it seems like some of you actually like me. And now we've reached the next chapter of this strange, beautiful journey together. As we're about to hit 3 million subscribers, I'm gonna do what I've always done, in the same exact place as I've always done it. I'm not doing it any different. Same place, same platform, same exact everything. What I've always done, I'm doing it again, more doing it the same way that I've done it. Except the only difference is, there's not a difference actually, it's completely the same place. Ethan, just one question. Are you ready to go? No, I need another minute. Actually, you know what? I, I gotta take a dump. Can you set the time back by like 20 minutes? All right. Well, there you have it. You know, I didn't want to get one up by these, these dramatic kids because I've been on, we've been on YouTube. All right, where's our fucking dramatic music? Where's YouTube reaching out to us and paying us and making us some bullshit dramatic trailer? I want to know where's my fucking respect. You know? Yeah. Sorry, I'm still recovering a little bit. So you know, yes, we're here and we're we were not we're not going anywhere. Okay. It's all about the respect. Thank you. Yo, you know how much they probably spent on those trailers for like Psycho and shit? We, that shit was free. We shot that shit in like 30 minutes. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, literally. I, I bet you YouTube spit dropped like 100K to produce that shit. Sure. It, it, theirs looked a, a little bit not better. Much, than ours. Not much. Not much better. Not by much, but it, it, yeah, you know. Well, you know, we made it. And that's respect. Just saying. <laughs> there you go, guys. No change. Y'all been goofed. You've been trolled. You've been had. You got zonked. You got zilly you zonked. You got fucking zilly zonked. You got zonked, my dudes. That was fun, though. <laughs> I love that cutaway where I was like, the pen, the mic is mightier than the pen. <laughs> and then I couldn't speak. I couldn't speak. Well. Ay, ay, ay. You know what's interesting, though? Dr. Disrespect been on YouTube for a long time. And he fucking hates YouTube gaming. Look at this. He tweeted this like the same day Saikuno uh, yeah. joined. And do what is Dr. D? He probably pulls pretty good numbers when he streams, right? Probably even better than... Well, Saikuno's uh, debut stream, when we popped in on it, had like 32k live viewers, which is about what we're sitting at right now. Uh, um, when no, we've got... Mm, we've got mm, th almost 33. Oh, okay. My, my bad. Can you round up a little I'm bit sorry. for me? Dan? You're right. That is 32.9. Thank you. Uh, repeating, of course. <laughs> repeating, um, of course. <laughs> but um, but yeah, uh, when Doctor Disrespect debuted on YouTube, it was like 200k or something. It was like absolutely bonkers. And no respect bonkers. for the man. And yeah, they they won't engage with him at all. Which I, I think they're just scared of whatever happened with Twitch. If I had to yeah. assume, or they're just like, cool, you're on here for free. F you. Right. But he says, I had to unfollow YouTube Gaming. They don't even support us. Why support them? It sounds like he can't even get some get a hold of someone. Yeah, well, I mean, that's a common thing at YouTube, right? Being difficult to get a hold of anybody. Unless you have Susan on speed dial like you. So I have no problem getting a hold of someone. <laughs> no, that's not true. I actually, lately, I, I have, I'm, it's not been a good time. Yeah. I wonder if we could get Doc to call in, because I'm kind of curious about his... Let me DM him right now. Yeah, he might be down to talk about it. Um, I'm curious about his experience. Because if we're going to all be joining YouTube, 
which I think is great. I love streaming on YouTube. I welcome all. I mean, it's great for us, right? Bring them all over. Let's get that whole pool swimming in. Uh, I'd um, argue it's good for both Twitch streamers and YouTube streamers. Get that competition. It kind of puts a fire on, under Twitch. Yeah. Hell yeah. yeah. Totally. Yeah. All right, I'm just messaging uh, Doc. Yeah. On the YouTube side, too, because, you know, YouTube just implemented uh, some features that have been on Twitch forever. Like, um, there is like a, I forget what they call it, but the equivalent of their raids mm -hmm. they've added to their live streaming recently and a, a few other things. So, yeah, I mean, you know. It's good that these platforms feel like they need to compete for talent. Bro, Dr. Disrespect's first stream had 400,000 live viewers, and he wow. can't even get someone to talk to. 400K? Yeah. Damn. That's nuts. That's like what the World Cup gets and shit. <laughs> That's what we get on a slow day, though. Yeah. Definitely. As the number one podcast in the world. Anyway, that's it. <laughs> Just fun times. But they're actually...